This will be the first video of my experience series. It is on Fangoria issue, which I should probably look up 151. Sorry, guys, I should probably look up the number before. But hey, I'm not perfect. But I'm going to tell you a little bit of backstory behind this one because it's very significant this being actual first one. Because this is the first one that actually got me into horror magazines. During my whole life, I never knew these existed. Yes, I know that is extremely shocking and I can't explain it 100%. Beyond the point that nobody in my family really read them and I was in a town that had a Walmart who didn't sell them. So I just avoided magazine aisles and being a little bit antisocial, I did not know anybody who did. So it was a great surprise on eBay one day when I was looking up things for Tremors. I was trying to find anything collectible. And I kind of bought this, I found this issue, and uh, my reaction was Tremors plus Horror plus Magazine. That was literally my issue, and I'm telling you there is a god, folks. There is a god out there, because this, this is amazing. So, on to my actual experience that are going to backstories. This was a Time Portal magazine. I'm going to put it under a Time Portal, and since when I was reading this, I thought it was back in the 90s. Yes, it was amazing. So it had Tremors 2, and it had Thinner, and it also had Hellmaster, and I'll do a little close-up. Not Hellmaster, Hellraiser, sorry. I always call Hellraiser Hellmaster, even though it's obvious Hellraiser. I have a tendency of getting t titles mixed up. Oopsie doopsie. But after what, reading this, I actually went and watched Thinner again, which... It's on YouTube, but it's not a very good quality. You can find it on Netflix. Get Netflix. But beyond the whole random Netflix things, there's a few issues, things in here, of course, that I had not watched. I have not watched every horror movie there is out there. I'm trying, but my God, there's a lot of them. They're not doing me any favors in the scenes of watching them all, but they are doing me favors, Give me a lot to watch. It's a double-edged sword there, folks. It's a double-edged sword. So I had an amazing experience with this. I was biased beforehand, though. I already fell in love with it. Before I even opened it up, I decided I was going to fall in love. And let's just give you a little preview of the contents page if you guys want to know what's in here. Just pause the video. And here's a random ad. And yes, I say random ads a lot because I am more focused on what's in the magazine that I'm amazed by. So this is probably one of my top experiences so far, except for one other where I opened up an ad and it was Tales from the Crypt. Yeah, I have that on unboxing. Somewhere, it's the newest issue of Fangoria 318, I believe. I can never remember what issue numbers they are. I'm horrible, folks. But this is my experience. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I enjoyed reading this, so I assume you enjoyed reading, well, watching me give an eye of little of my experience on it. So, um, until later, I'll bid you adieu and hope you have a good day slash night in whatever part of the world you happen to be in.